I just got back from an interview with a past life expert, and that's what this video is going to be about today. Welcome to the Astral Mage. I'm Heidi, and let's talk about past life experts. Whoa. Okay, so I am still safe and snug here, even though it is storming outside, and I am lucky that I got back from my interview before this happened. You know, I'm really loving it. Today, I had the interview with Marie Terlon. Oh my God, I said her name wrong. It's Mariah Terlon. She's a beautiful past life regressionalist. I'm saying past life expert for those of you who do not know what a past life regressionalist is. A past life regressionalist is somebody who will help you to remember your past lives through hypnosis or maybe other ways, but the way she does it is through hypnosis. And we're gonna get into that in the interview and she's gonna explain things that I really wanted to know. So I wrote down the questions that I had for her and made my way there. You know, I have already known her for a while. I had been to her regressions twice. Once I went to one of her regressions and once she came to my shop. Back then I had a little shop. It really was very interesting to explore those territories and that's why I reached out to her and wanted to get some more answers and a little bit more depth. I made my way to her beautiful home. She showed me around. She showed me her beautiful, you know, work area because she is also, it's also her home, but also her work space. And then we sat down together and had this lovely interview. So here it is. How does a past life regression work here with you, Mariah? So in a past life regression it takes about five to six hours and it's really a deep dive for people. Usually people also only need one session because we get to all the different questions that they have about their life. Now it consists basically of three different parts. And the first part of the session is just you and I talking about your current life, because whatever past life is going to show up, it's always directly linked to something going on in your current life. The second part of the session, you will lie down on the bed that I have in my office and I will guide you to a past life. You're of course the one experiencing the past life, but it's your higher self that decides whatever past life it wants to show you because it knows exactly where you are in your life and it knows exactly what's going to help you move forward in your life. And then there's the third part of the regression, which is the part where I ask your higher self to move directly through you. You're basically lending your voice to your higher self. And then we get to ask all the big life questions that you have. What distinguishes a past life regression through hypnosis from past life regression in dreams? Is there like a distinction there? Now, past lives can come through in many different ways. Of course, in a regression, you have a regressionist there who can ask and guide you through the different phases of the past life, but they can also come up spontaneously, like in dreams, but also it happens to me right before I'm waking up sometimes, or when I'm visiting a certain location that all of a sudden spontaneous memories of a past life can come through. If you have that, if a spontaneous memory comes through and you are aware, I always tell people become your own past life regressionist, you know, ask a lot of questions, keep the ball moving. What's going on? How do you feel? What's happening next? And this way, like a regression, you can get as most out of it as you can. So is there a memory from one of your past lives that really stands out to you as something special that you'd like to share with us? Uh, so yeah, there's been, of course, many different past lives that I've already seen. One that I saw last year was a past life where I was myself prosecuted as a witch in a previous lifetime. I don't think I even was very witchy witchy, but I was a woman whose man already passed away. I had plenty of money and I had a lot of opinions to voice about things that I didn't agree with in the world. And therefore I got prosecuted and burned on the stake together with a couple other witches. And it's interesting because I've seen many of my other clients going through similar lifetimes because a lot of my clients, of course, are spiritual people. They have been spiritual in the past life or that again in this life. The big difference now, though, is in this time, it's completely safe to voice your opinions. It's completely safe to practice your spirituality and also be open to it. So that's a very exciting topic that keeps coming back and back with me and my clients. So this is a question that I really want to know about. It's really interesting for me. Are there any thoughts about 
simultaneous lives that you have because I have like these dreams where I'm living completely different lives. I'm still me, but I am just a, have a different family and a different lifestyle and everything. So what are your thoughts on that? Uh, that's a really interesting question. And there are actually a couple different answers to this question, but the most simplified explanation I can give to you, and this is something that my teacher Dolores Cannon talks about, is that she says, besides this earth, there's many parallel earths. Earths in a higher frequency, earth, earth in a lower frequency. And because the frequency is different from the one that you're focused on, uh, you cannot see the other ones. You're focused in this frequency and therefore this is your reality. But Dolores describes that for every choice, you do not make another part of you has made that choice and is also living out that choice and that's being lived out in one of these parallel universes parallel earths and it sounds that you have access to this in your dreams which is really beautiful because when you're going in your dream state your soul is traveling all over the place and it can go to different dimensions it can go to parallel lives it can go to the future time past time because honestly everything really is simultaneous it's called past life regression, but the past life is also happening at right at this moment, which is really hard for us to comprehend. I don't think we're meant uh, to comprehend this, but as soon as you die, as soon as you leave the body, essentially all time is happening at the same time. And the same with parallel lives, past lives, future lives, all creation is right now. Thank you so much for this talk. And if anybody wants to know anything more and have, have more questions, I mean, I'm sure there's thousands of questions. You can just check in the link below and I will put Mariah's information there. So the storm is dying down and our video is wrapping up. And if this video was helpful for you, please like and subscribe and share and leave me a comment. And please remember your magical experience matters. And I'm looking forward to seeing you next time. Bye. <laughs>